Today our topic is how to calibrate access robot. You need to calibrate robot pendulum or access if your robot batteries was drained or if you have a lot of alarm on revolution counter. In order to do that, you need to stop the robot in a clear or home position, switch the key to manual mode, and locate the calibration routine on the teeth pendant and execute it. And in worst case, your robot lost the motion command, then you need to jog the robot in joint mode and locate the witness mark. Jogging in joint mode means you can move each axis independently. A typical robot have six axes. Reminder, if your robot have a tooling, you need to drop it in a rack or cart because sometimes your robot located on a tight space and once you execute the calibration routine, then you probably hit the guarding or fence of the robot. If this is your first time here, please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that every time I will upload a new video, you will be notified. And also, check my other video like interview question and answer, hydraulic pneumatic, FANOC robotics, motor controls, and many more. Now let's proceed. Click the main menu of the teach pendant. Click calibration. Highlights rope 1, then click. After that, click Calibration Parameters, and then click Find Calibration, and then click Yes to Acknowledge, and then check Robot Access to be calibrated. If you want all access of the robot to be calibrated, click 1 to 6. For example, here we choose access number 3. After that, click Calibrate. And then click Calibrate. Find Calibration finished successfully. Click OK. Now go back to your main menu. And click Jogging. And check Robot Access 1 to 6 if it is 0. In this case, our all robot access are zero, so we're good to go. So that means our robot is calibrated now. Next, I'm going to show you the witness mark of every axis of the robot. But first, I'm going to familiarize you the main component of robot. This is the base, this is the first arm, and this is the second arm. And this is the joint one, joint two, joint three, joint four, joint five, and joint six. This is the axis number one, and this is the mechanical drawing showing which locations of axis number one. Axis or joint one. Axis or joint two, located on first arm. This is the location of axis two. And this is the actual location of axis two on the robot. This is axis three. And this is the actual locations of mechanical drawing and actual locations of the mechanical robot. Axis 4, this is the tough view.
and this is the actual location of access port on the robot access or joint 5 this is the actual location and this is the actual location of mechanical robot and the last one is axis 6 and this is the actual locations of the drawing and actual locations of the robot that's it guys if you like this video don't forget to like share and subscribe have a good one